Okay, so if you're watching this, which you are, it means that our first podcast is live and it is exciting, it is super fun. This video is just gonna be documenting the process of making the vlog, making the content, making the branding. So, I hope you enjoy it. It's a mini vlog, it's very short, but I wanted to put something out there just so you guys can follow along in the journey, you know? At the end of this, I'll include a little clip of the podcast, so stay the whole thing. Without it, it's only like three or four minutes long, so not a, not a huge investment of your time, but if you're interested in what's going on with the podcast, this is the way to find out. Thank you guys so much for watching. Enjoy it. Hey guys, welcome to the video. My name is Jean, spelled like Jean, and today is totally dedicated to getting the podcast going. We got a photo shoot coming up with my brother right now, one of our friends. Been working on behind the scenes stuff all morning. It's been a good day. Let's let's do this. Put him in the dirt, say it again, man, and that's a reverse. Uh, uh, never, never rehearse, jump in it first. Call up the nurse, put the beat in the hearse. Uh, this is absurd. Say to preserve, don't get on the tracks, man, and they better swerve. Don't got a nerve, man, I never curse. Just casting these spells when I'm spelling these words. Hello. Obviously, since I'm doing the podcast, he's doing the podcast. We're here. We're going. We out here. But as I walked in, you gave me a present that I wasn't expecting. Oh, I, well, I thought you were going to talk about what I farted. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that happened too. I gave him a fart present on accident. But yeah, I gave John some shoes. Woo! What's funny is I literally just shot my shoes as I was walking in. And then now no, I have different shoes on. And then I gave him a book too. <laughs> Woo! So what's the plan today? Hopefully find my sunglasses in my car. And then, and then we're, we're going to take pictures. All right, so we just got downtown. I love downtown and had a parallel park. And that tight spot, not a problem. I crushed that. No. That's a lie. <laughs> and that's not a tight spot. It's like eight feet right there. It was very hard for me to park there. Someone had to get outside and help me. I just Gracie, said. what yeah. are we doing? We are. This is my first time doing a shoot with boys, so I can't be like, hey, put your hand on your waist and do your hair like this. Uh, yeah, we can. We're, <laughs> we're men. <laughs> I said boys, I didn't say men. So right now is my individual time with this uh, photo shoot action going on. They're over there. Right now, I'm just filling up time because I'm making it look like I'm vlogging, which in, in I am, in reality, because I'm gonna use this and it's recording. Um, but mainly I'm doing this so that they can get some camera shots of me vlogging, and it's it's a good time. We're, we're having a good time over here. Are we good? Yeah, keep going. Keep going, keep going. Yeah. So that last place we went was really simple, really minimal. This place, that we're at now, we're actually waiting to walk up to it because we're gonna take some photos. Um, it's very loud and exciting. It's a mural, so yep, it'll be fun. There's a lot of driving traffic by and be looking at us, taking pictures like dummies. Yep, and also uh, a school just, just good times. Yeah, here. children walking by, all that fun. All the recipes for a great video vlogging experience. Photo shoot done. What do you think? They were great. Yeah, so over here. No. They were. <laughs> they were good. He's hungry though. So. We all we all got a little hungry. Yeah. If you haven't heard of Will Smith, then <laughs> something going yeah. on there. <laughs> yeah. Um, but he's really. <laughs> what if someone's like, oh, I know Will Smith, the YouTuber. Yeah. But I've yeah. never heard. I don't the... get why he's so popular on YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> um. But he actually put out a video where he's talking about the other side of fear, you know, and like how um, it was with him and skydiving or something. And he was like, freedom lies on the other side of fear. And it's so true because yeah. it's like, I love Will Smith. Oh, my gosh. But it's like, it's so true because if you just live by fear, then you're always afraid. Obviously, you're always afraid. You're always like you've got this like literal wall that you can't see past. Mm -hmm. But then when you cross that wall, when you go over it, you realize everything that you were so afraid of is so small. And like now there's like this open field in front of you and we're growing like 
eventually you go through that open field and you find another wall that looked way bigger than your other wall and you cross that and there's another open field and it's like there's so much freedom that lies on the other side of fear well, it's, the wall. it's so true and like this is kind of a, a silly like you know i guess a uh, way to explain it but for me example there we go i couldn't think of the word um for me like the the best way to explain that is like when i the first time i went to six flags i was terrified to go on any roller coaster and like i i remember i went through a couple lines and didn't go on the roller coaster right so i would go literally like you go through the line i would step on the, the cart and just go to the other side because <laughs> i was like i just oh well i didn't want to be alone so i would wait in line with my friends yeah. but then once i finally went on the first roller coaster i went on every other single one afterwards yeah because i was like i wasn't scared anymore yeah you know and like that it was like that it was if i would just been so afraid i wouldn't have done it but then once i was over the fair fear it was like okay let's go 